Oh, good day, YouTube. How's it going? Well, I just wanted to show you this freaking cool website I got here that I use for uh, getting my fonts and <clears throat> pardon my French stuff for um, doing the vinyl stuff and you know things like that, eh? So they've got it's called dafont.com and they got all these categories, you know, like the freaking cartoon, comic, groovy, all this kind of stuff, eh? And these are just freaking loaded with fonts and stuff, eh? So, uh, well, let's start this cartoon one. And you can change your here from to show 10 fonts to 50 fonts per page. I'll just resubmit that. And you could actually input text here, custom preview. So we'll do like B I L L S T M A X X. And then hit submit again there. Then it's going to change the fonts to. Um, what you want for oh it's got a nice heart freak sakes but um pretty sweet eh for you know all the different fonts you can get and I could just I'll show you I can download one of these do the thing up and then cut her out just like that you know so I just sort of been looking through and you know there's freaking endless amounts that's actually kind of neat that one so I'm gonna download that one and save it's actually the Yahoo font. Huh, that's funny, eh? Interesting. But yeah, like there's so many on here, you just sort of get mesmerized by the man. You just go past them because they're, you know, that's what I find I do. I just end up getting mesmerized and stop looking at how neat they are. And it's just like, oh, there's another one. You know, like that one's sort of neat too. You know, this whole wax. Oh, another heart. Must be just me. Oh, another heart right there. Oh. Holy crap, see this one's kind of cool, it looks like, like cracked stone or something, eh? But, um, you gotta think too though, if I got this and then cut this out of vinyl, all these little things down in here, if you can see where the finger thing is there. So on the X here, say all these little things is gonna want to cut that too, right? So yeah, it looks neat there, but sometimes it's a nightmare for freaking cutting. So, yeah. I kind of like to get these kind that are solid ones rather than these because when you cut this it's going to leave this but it's also going to cut the inside out so you're going to have to peel that inside off and all you're going to see is really that so whatever your background color is going to be that with like a little black outline or whatever color outline right oh look at this one that would just be a nightmare it's called snot by toxic type is the guy that invented it snot yeah that's about right Trying to cut that, unless it was really huge, be a nightmare. So we're at some 3D ones too, you know. So I don't like to fill my whole font folder up with stuff like that, you know. That would be a nightmare to cut. So, but I mean, what did I select here? 50 fonts per page, and I've got 14 plus pages just in cartoon. So you can imagine how freaking mesmerizing this gets, you know. But uh, I'll go through here and uh, it's kind of a neat one too, a big boldy one, you know. Toonish, it's called. I'll go through here for a little while and pick out some cool ones. Oh, look at this one. <laughs> Decapitated. <laughs> oh, that's nasty. Holy gee, you see, there's everything, eh? It's just ridiculous. But yeah, I'll go through this, I'll pick out some cool ones, and then I'll show you how to install them. Yeah, this is pretty cool too. It's uh, got a thing here. Uh, how many times each font, whatever's been downloaded, eh? And even how many times yesterday hmm, it's been downloaded. That's pretty cool. But there's one here. Uh, it's called Accents. And uh, I'll show you here. The camera a bit. This one here. You know, it's pretty neat. Square sort of looking. 26 comments. And it's been downloaded that many times. And just yesterday it was downloaded that many times. So holy frig, eh? People must really like that one for some reason. Alrighty, so I got a few of them. And these are all like uh, WinZip, uh, WinRAR Zippy zip files. So holy jeez, that's unexpected. Sometimes you'll get one of these fonts and they'll have like a whole bunch of the different size of different things of fonts and uh, you know, one's like italicized, and like there's a whole whack of them here by the looks of things, so, uh, 
Okay. But I found with this Windows, oh, this is gonna suck. I'm just gonna do this first one here. Uh, See, so yeah, there's a 3D one, you know, like, just ridiculous. So I can't install it right out of this. I gotta uh, copy it to my my desktop. Let's see, get back up here. So I copied that to the desktop. Oh, come on. And uh, then you gotta, you can just double click it. It shows you, shows you all what it's gonna look like, anyways. Okay, so this is how you install the font. So you can use it throughout your whole Windows thing. Even if you were like typing up a letter, you could still use it. So go to your uh, computer thing and then click your hard drive and go to the Windows. And then down here you'll see fonts. Double click it and click your font drag it over and you'll see this bloop needs permission a eh? freaking vista um you just click continue bloop done so yeah that's uh that's how you install a font so that one was called bloodlust 3d so what we're going to do now is go into the uh, cutting program sign go and that's just the thing i plugged in and you drag out a freaking uh, thingy there and B I L L S T M A X X and for your font you just go there and you get your blood lust B L many blood ones here it's hard to see it holy blood lust 3D there it is so there she is so now I'll go to the that most. So yeah, if I cut that out, that's what she'd cut out like. Whoop, sorry tubes. There she be. Okay, so now you found out you got a whole bunch of these freaking zip files that you can't uh uh you gotta open them all, so you just select them all and then uh, uh right click them and then say Oh, where the freak was it? Oh for Freak sakes. Scrap files. There, that's what we wanted. And you gotta go find a folder. And we'll just all, and hopefully it has extracted them all to here, which it looks like it has. So that's good. And now we just do the same thing, but it looks like I got a couple of PNG files and crap I don't really need. So I'll just go clean this up and then I'll install them all at once. Alrighty, so with our uh, font folder from Windows still open there, we're going to select all here and then move them over to there. And it brings up our thing. And... Oh! Oh, that one's already installed. Want to replace it? Uh, sure. Uh, no, maybe not. And Bloodlust, we just did. 3D's installed, so no. And boom, we're done. So we got all these uh, freaking fonts in our font folder now, which is pretty super wicked awesome. And yeah, you just go in and use them like you would normally any other font, and uh, we you go. So yeah, that's uh, pretty cool uh, where I get all the fonts and stuff from and uh, how you install them and stuff and then you can use them and print with them and cut out stuff with them or whatever you want. So um, I got a good amazing fact here for you, so let's go to the world's most amazing fact. And now it's time for the world's most amazing fact. Okay, so this one's pretty cool. Uh, it says here, uh, if you stretch a standard slinky metal slinky out flat so it's one sh flat thing it measures 87 feet long that's a lot of slinky in that little bundle of freaking slinky